Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So we just came back from our three day staycation and at home we don't have cable so it was kind of fun being able to watch cable again. One of the TV shows I got addicted to is the Home Network um, Flip or Flop by uh, Talek and Christina. Oh my gosh, that show is so amazing and so inspiring that the home decor bug totally got me. So yeah, I just got back from my thrift store and I spent $10 for everything. That's including the lamp and all the decor, everything was um, 10, actually it was like $9, but I just gave her $10 and I just let them keep the change. But yeah, anyways, let's just jump right in. So the first thing that I have is this cute treasure case thing here. Like I'm kind of loving the farmhouse shabby chic kind of look right now, but I still want to have like clean minimalist lines and not too much shabby chic. And so, um, yeah, we'll see how that turns out. And then I thought this would be a really cute thing to put a plant in. Really cute, just simple white. I am. I just brought it home. I didn't clean it or anything. So, um, yeah, so they're all still a little bit dusty, but I was just so excited to share it with you guys. And then I got this lamp right here. I really like the shape of the body. And then it has like this cool pulley knob thing in here. And it does work. It does need a little bit of scrubbing. And then... Um, I like the shape of the lampshade as well. I'm gonna try and try to paint it or spray paint it. I don't know. Then I got this cute, this is um, like a decor. Um, I believe it's a floating shelf because there's knobs in the back that you can hang it up. And this was originally from Ross uh, for $8. It looks like they didn't even use this. I'm planning to spray paint this white. I think this would look so cute white and as you can see all my walls in the house are all bare I don't have anything really hanging yeah that would look so cute white and then I got floss it's brand new in the package so I thought hey why not I think this was like 25 cents and then I thought this thing is really cute too this glass thingy I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet I'm thinking leave it like on our nightstand if we want to put our jewelry in it or i have no idea but i just thought it was such a cute piece and for 25 cents can't go wrong it just looks very glamorous and cute and then i got this silver thing right here this was 20 oh 50 cents and then this tree and and this was my favorite find for today how cute is this glass jar? It's adorable, isn't it? I love it. When I saw this, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to have it. I'm probably going to put it somewhere around there. Since that's kind of like my more glamorous corner, I guess. I have no idea yet. But I will definitely find a space for it. And then this cute serving dish here. I thought that was a really pretty plate. And then I got a couple of floating shelves here. And then two lampshades. I really like the shape of these. Really cute. And I hope they fit my lamps. The one that's all the way over there is the same one that's in my room. I hope that it fits. I think it will. I really like the shape of like the more circular looks. So you guys, I just put the new lampshade on the lamps. And it fits perfect. It's one of these weird lampshades where the wire thing actually goes before the bulb and it fitted perfect. So I'm really happy about that. I can get rid of these weird shaped ones here and I had to like MacGyver it to hold it on. So yeah, this one's a lot more safe and it's the actual fit for this lamp. So that's pretty awesome and I, I'm really excited about that. So no more red airplanes. I just spray painted the lampshade and then I taped off the rest of the stand to leave it the silver color. And then the treasure box that I was so excited to find.
I still have to put a couple more shelves up that I got from the thrift store. I still have to spur paint that red one and I'm probably going to put those in the bathroom because my bathrooms are pretty um, sparse. But I did put up this shelf in my son's room. I have to patch the little puka here. <laughs> I just put my hubby's like trophy thing that he got in 2012. He got third place in the Umelo Olua Challenge in 2012. And it's my son's room right now. And his crazy collection of this grocery gangs. Oh my gosh. Way too many. Not minimalist at all. And then that's his closet and some of his stuff that he has hanging on his wall. Okay, and now we're going to go into my bathroom. So as you can see, my bathroom walls are really sparse. Nothing hanging up in there. So I'm probably going to put the red shelf um, when I spray paint it white. I'll probably hang it up either here or on this wall. What do you guys think? What wall should it go on? And then... Um, that's my sink area and then I use that cute jar and I just put some cotton and some q-tips in there and I really love how that looks just really clean 